All right, so if we're going to factor number three, we have p squared plus 9p plus 20. And so if we do our puzzle, something plus something is going to equal what? Nine. Nine. And something times something is going to equal my b and equals a times c, which is 20. What is my answer to my puzzle? Four plus five, is that what you got? Four and five. And so that means that P squared plus four P plus five P plus 20, right? So inside my box is going to go P squared plus four P plus 20. So what's my GCF here? What's my GCF here? What's my GCF here? And my GCF here is positive 4. So it's going to be what? C plus What are my two puzzles? Why are we talking, guys? You should be listening. I'm not sure why we're talking. Looking at the number five. Something plus something equals my B. What's my B? Something times something equals A times C. Negative 18. So, what are my factors of 18? 1 times 18. 2 times 9. 3 times 6. So it's got to be 3 and 6, right? It's got to be 3 and 6. But negative, negative, one, three. negative 3 and 6. So I set myself up. I keep the n squared, but this is going to be negative 3 n and positive 6 n. So n squared minus 3 n plus 6 n minus 18. What's my GCF here? Plus 6. GCF here. And GCF here. Ladies, are y'all listening? Be careful. Not three, but they're both negative, so it's going to be negative three. We've got to have a negative. So one of my factors is so which are you seeing the connection? If it's just p squared or just n squared, my two factors are my puzzle. <laughs>